Yo, what is going on everyone? It is Memory here. We are everyone, ladies and gentlemen, for the fifth episode of Yamada-kun and the Seven Witches. And we're going to hop right into this episode, everyone, and see what we got going. We're starting at the very beginning, zero seconds, and we're going to hop into this in three, two, one, play. So, we got some pretty interesting developments going on. Actually, we're starting with the opening, which I think is at first. Uh, but now, what I was about to say, uh, we have some pretty interesting developments going on, like with the body swapping. We also have, like, now this charm kind of ability, I guess. And, it, it, you know, we saw it happen, like, with Miyamura and Ito after uh, Yamada kissed Nene. So... We're going to see what we have going on with that, but it's seeming like definitely that what we initially thought about this whole body swapping thing and what you know, Yamada had is actually not the case at all. So, um, like I said, interested to see you know, where they go from here, what, you know, what happens for sure. Because we got body swapping now, like the charm kind of thing. We still have a lot more girls to be introduced to as well, so there's probably going to be even more of these crazy uh, <laughs> abilities. Not like super out there, because I know we've had body swapping in anime, and the charm thing isn't really anything like super original or special, but I mean, it is still kind of cool. I I'm interested to see what other ones we'll have. Also, it was nice to see Shirashi uh, warming up to some of the other girls and spending the time with the having some girl time girl talk opening up more with the summer camp or the school trip and all that so and yeah she was right here right when <laughs> Yamato was about to leave you mustn't kiss her okay hey not <laughs> yeah now's a bad time with the situation yeah <laughs> this is giving you some time but like with these like the body swapping and the charm Yamada definitely has some kind of special thing about him that that has something to do with the abilities so we don't know exactly what that is yet but I'm curious as to what that's going to be. It makes sense. There's something special with him because he's the main character. But <laughs> <laughs> Running away from him like that. <laughs> oh, is it lunchtime now? Oh. <laughs> wow. Uh, now you're going to give her the wrong idea, Yambada. <laughs> Aw. So this is why they were running from him. <laughs> that makes sense. Man, they really look up to her, man. They really, <laughs> especially the two dudes. They really got it. Yeah. Oh, well, even the girl as well. <laughs> Many elite guards. Seriously. <laughs> Seriously. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's messed up, man. Hmm. You jealous? I was just about to say that. Yeah, I was just about to... <laughs> he stuttered there. He's definitely jealous. <laughs> Okay, so him kissing her, you know, led to this whole charming thing going on, yeah. So he has, so she has kind of a, uh, 
one of these abilities, strange abilities as well. He hasn't noticed he's in love with you yet, but we saw Miyamura and Ito, like, remember how we saw them with, towards the end of the previous episode, how they were acting with Yamada? You don't suppose, that could be maybe the special thing about Yamada, like, Like he can, like we saw a little bit of that. We were thinking about that in the previous episode. Like he has some way of like negating it or. Whoa, wait, <laughs> wait, what just happened to her? <laughs> that was like a flip of a switch, like. Right. So he's gonna he's gonna tell Shirashi about what what the deal is. He's he's not gonna keep it from her. I like that. <laughs> Let's see what happens. What, they might actually yeah, just switch like normal. They switched. <laughs> Don't kiss her anymore. So maybe with... Oh. Wow, they're right here. <laughs> oh, shit. So maybe with Shirashi kissing Yamada, that took her charm thing out of the equation. That just totally got rid of that. Maybe now he has it, because, I mean, she, the way she's feeling for, yeah, she's fallen prey to her own spell. So, like, Yamada must have, like, I don't know. Does he have the ability to, like, take others' take others' abilities or something? Because that's the body swapping and now the charm. First, the power is to charm others, right? So you kissed her when you kissed. Oh, and that's his power. His power is to copy. Because this whole time, it's he's thought it's been the body swapping thing. So the copy thing would make sense now that, especially with this Nene development, he ends up po copying the power. So the body swapping is the charm. That's two. her <laughs> so she has the ability <laughs> to switch bodies I guess she could have just came out and told him from the start maybe about that she had this or did she like not know or damn jeez you show <laughs> yeah, he's that pissed that Nene's like this about him, huh? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, no. Wow. So now we have some of the facts straight, though. Yamada has the ability to copy her, like, copy the abilities. Shirashi has the body swap, and Nene has the, the charm.
I'm surprised I even remembered his name, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> that one didn't work out. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> didn't go according to plan, huh? This should have made them friends then. <laughs> they could both relate. <laughs> no, maybe not. <laughs> this is a while ago that yeah, this is on their first day, but still even to this point, like <laughs> both kinda in the same boat. And here we are now. <laughs> They're brawling. Sure, she just pulls out her, her one of her books. And just, wow. That's why Miyamura and Ito were the same way. That yeah, that's the explanation. Domino will copy her power once more, and cancel out the charm state. Kiss to, so kissing her again would cancel it out. Well, that's how it works for the for the body swapping, right? <laughs> it's the same concept. He's not going to do it? <laughs> wow. This man's going to make things right for for his for N uh, Nene. Yeah, I mean, look at him. He's on his knees and everything, yo. <laughs> That's how much she means to him, yo. Wow. Seems pretty genuine, pretty serious, too. Damn. I mean, I, I, it's kind of tough to turn him down, you know. I, I wouldn't probably in this situation. Just being stubborn. Even if that's not how she really feels about him, like, it's because of the charm she does now. But, damn. Whoa. Yeah, she's like... Nene really has nothing to... Like, no real choice in the matter. Like, yeah, she can't really control the situation because of the Yamada's copy thing that, you know, she didn't really know about. <laughs> <laughs> she can't have any other girls being in love with him <laughs> or falling for him like that. That's that's probably the thing, Shirashi. You got your little 
little uh, goals or ambitions of your own. <laughs> Likes who he is now compared to what they had before, as we saw in that flashback. Maybe, uh, maybe. Oh, is that Nene right there? Yeah, it is. <laughs> wow. That kick, man, I tell you, he has that drop kick down, <laughs> down pat. <laughs> Yamada with that shit, all these guys with it. Noni? <laughs> what? <laughs> Nene. Nene and Yushio? Whoa, he didn't know about this. Because Yushio was the one who... Oh, that's what... Yeah. That's what happened. Now oh, that makes sense. Through her charms of <laughs> with with Yushio, she <laughs> led Yushio to do that. What could this be about? <laughs> yep. <laughs> of course. <laughs> she wants to st stay this way? Oh. Is that the same like the same way with her? Like she she, she likes feeling like this? <laughs> Yo. Oh, he went and did it. Or did he? Oh. Damn, he actually did do it then. <laughs> she went back to how she is. she usually is. Wow. Damn. That wasn't, I mean, that was the, the, the because of the charm. That's not really how she is, you know, N how Nada is, so. Wow. 
which is well, Shirashi. <laughs> um Day Day, we have two. The witch's power is as follows. One, the power to charm. Two, the power of telepathy. The rest of can continue vine. Don't have it. So we know there's a t uh, telepathy ability. So we only have two now. There's more. There's way more to come. <laughs> Ito's loving this, of course. <laughs> the witch detector. <laughs> He's very useful in that in that regard. Yeah. She's like, no, yeah, <laughs> deep down. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Nene and Yushio joining? Yeah, I mean, this is what they wanted, yeah, and the, when they first came here, we saw on the first day, that that is true. And now look what they have, yeah, that is true, very true, because <laughs> Yamane has, like, Shirashi, you know, uh, Miyamura, Ito, Yushio has Nene, like, yo, he likes what he has, even though apparently he's been charmed, right, he, he you know, he still likes this more than what he had, so, you know, they do have these people, right, that is initially what they wanted, so that's kind of cool what they, what they did with that. Um, so we've, you know, fully learned what is kind of going on with what, well, for now, we know, you know, we know there's more ability users and, you know, powers and all that or whatever you want to say. Um, but we know Shirashi has the body swapping, Nene has the charm, and then Yamada has the ability to copy, all right? So that's, that's crazy. So, um, that makes Yamada really important, right? If they're, if the other's abilities don't you know, like work on them or you know, the way he can you know kind of turn it around as we've saw with the body swapping and we saw with the charm obviously too because he t you know, flipped it right around on Nene and that was so that, that's kind of interesting what we have with with Yamada and that in that as aspect because the whole time we thought and the characters in our show have thought that Yam or you know that Yamada was the one uh who had the uh body swapping thing so Nice little development twist, I'd say. <laughs> Fun episode too. I, I like the um. I like the the focus. Oh, it looks like we're gonna have like a beach episode next episode. Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! Okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, what was I about to say? Man, that totally just threw me off. I totally forgot what I was about to say. Oh my gosh. Oh, I was about to say I like what they did with Yushio and and, and um. And Yamada, like with the flashback and how they, you know, kind of wanted things to go in school, like how they wanted things to go or how they thought they were going to go, like making friends and, and all of that. And then both of them actually ended up, you know, turning out alone and it wasn't really fun. And now, now look where they're at. I mean, they have people around them. They're, they're having, I'd say fun, right? They're, they're having fun with, with, with this kind of thing. I mean, Yushio said he likes the life, you know, he has. And obviously Yamada with the, you know, the supernatural uh, studies club and all that and, and what they have right now is, is special too so it's kind of nice how it, it's it's came to to this point for for Yushio and Yamada but um 
So yeah, still some more. We we know probably the since we didn't see any of the other abilities, we saw the charm one. Um, the other one was t um, telepathy. We'll probably end up seeing that one next since that's the next one they mentioned that we that we heard. So we'll 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 see what happens with that though. Pretty good episode, I gotta say. Uh, let me know what you all thought of this episode of Yamada Kun and the Seven Witches. If you all did enjoy the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace out.